I'm Ralph Bellamy. I want to tell you a story of tens of thousands of Jewish children, which is also the story of two frightened little girls. You know, this great book of Jewish wisdom, the Talmud, says that he who saves one life, it's as though he saves the world. And that's what the film you're about to see is really about. It actually began a long time ago in 1934 in Germany with the exodus of Jewish children fleeing from Nazi terror. And as this terror spread, the arms of a movement called Youth Aliyah opened to take them in. First to Palestine, later to Israel. First they came almost entirely from Western European lands. Now they come from Iron Curtain countries and the lands of the Arabs. But it's about two little ones who fled from Yemen that I want to tell you. Here she is, Tamar. Beautiful, talented, poetic like all her people. Thinking in the language of the Bible. Only 15. Whose mother died just after the family reached Israel. Leaving her to care for Yael, just four years old who became ill and was too young to go to the Mossad with her. The Mossad is the children's village in the cooperative settlement where the children long to live. Here other youth Aliyah children are already making a new life. Here they too could come, if only they had a little patience, until funds were found so they could stay permanently. Rachel, proud native-born Israeli, teacher in the Mossad was their friend, as was Anna, gentle Anna, an English girl, a psychologist come to Israel to pour out her love and her knowledge to help them all. Tell me, do you too believe that to save one life is to save the world? Then don't forget, don't forget those who wait as you watch this lucky group for whom Youth Aliyah has already found a place. As you watch Tamar and Yael trying to join them before their time. As you follow these sisters on the way to redemption.
faster, faster, little sister, by the shorter way. How slowly she goes, as if she didn't care. Quickly, Yael, quickly. You must make them listen. What is it, Rachel? Their mother died two weeks ago, and they've been trying to join a group of Yusalia children ever since. Have they been living at the camp alone since their mother died? David says they've been placed with an aunt, also a newcomer from Yemen, who has a house full of children, and the girls keep running away. David says the aunt lives nearby. What do we do? Well, first send David ahead with the convoy to the Mossad. And let us take the children back to the Marbara. We must speak to the aunt and see what's the matter. How's the girl why she's running away? Tamar, madoshen borchot mi beit hadoda. They tried to join the youth alia group at the camp. We brought them back to their aunt. Their aunt has already a full house. You can see for yourself. Where is it? Right here. They do not understand us. We are to them as two among thousands and tens of thousands. Poor Yael. How I have pressed her. She sits like a tired lamb with all desire of life gone out of her. I too am so tired and lonely. Mother. Oh, mother. The child is definitely sick. You can bet that take her to the hospital. Sister, I have to join my group in the Mossad. Would you go with Anna to the hospital? If you will need me, I will go. Good. At 
last we leave you, Ma Barat. Is this goodbye? Will we be coming back? I feel no joy in this farewell. The faces seem to mock us. The tents seem to say, we shall see thee again. Shalom. Shalom. as if they mean to keep her here. Oh, Mother, what shall I do? I promise never to leave her. And if they say she must remain, where shall I go? To the Mossad? Well, surely it will be so. And Yael, she sacrificed to my stubborn desire. Oh, Mother, what shall I do? I gave you my word. Sister, I'm afraid the child is rather ill. She'll have to stay here for a bit. Even as I feared, so it is coming to pass. It is like an evil dream I cannot waken from. Well, what kind of a diet would you like her on? I'd keep her on fluids until the diagnosis is more clear. Oh, yes, sister, would you please notify the Euphalia representative uh, that we are admitting the child? Yes, I will do that. Shalom. Shalom. Are you the youthfully a representative? Yes. You just brought us a little girl. That's right. Well, she's quite ill. She'll have to be here a little while. How can I leave thee, my love, my little lamb, my loved one? Did I not swear I would not leave thee? I fear the thought of it. Shalom. I see. How long do you think that will be? Well, we'll have to do some diagnostic procedures first. And then we really can't tell. For should I leave thee, will he who took our mother bereave me once again, because I was so vain? Shema boy henna. I think I'll take Shema back now with me, and we'll get in touch with you about the little one. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Shalom. Shalom. The Shema? Here at last, the Mossad. Oh, if only Yael were with me now. She is with me now. See, Yael? The trees, the houses, the water flying into the air. Surely our dear friend Sarah will be waiting to greet us. would bow down to the breezes. I knew how the breeze would whisper shalom to the grasses. They chided me in Yemen. Awake, thou dreamer, awake, for Israel is far, far to the north. But the elders said, we shall fly on wings of eagles. Dance, dance, Tamar, the blossoms urge. This is no dream of a Yemenite afternoon. This is thy garden of Israel come true. I say to my feet, rise on thy toes and turn. I say to my throat, sing high and low for gladness. 
But I cannot dance a step or make a song. For I think I hear a lamb bleeding in the hills. But come to thee no harm, my lamb, my little one. What shepherd has left thee thus, alone in the hills? Fingers are cleverer than a fork, yet see how the fork defies them? I feel like a child learning how to walk. יש לך גם כובע וגרביים אני רואה. יש לך כובע וגם גרביים. כן. יש לך כובע וגם רוסית יפה. כן, באמת יפה מאוד. יש לך חצאים. כן. חצאית. תודה רבה. בבקשה. לאן אתן הולכות עכשיו? אז נלך מסנדריה להפסיק בשבילה נלילה. יפה מאוד. שלום להתראות. שלום. Where is Mara, Rachel? She just went to the shoemaker. Oh, that's good. I think you have her clothes. Yes. Good. Let me help you. Thank you. I must tell you, Rachel, every adjustment without her sister is going to be difficult. She will have a hard time at first. I understand. This is our first problem. We must face it. New shoes for old. Oh, how sturdy and bold. How heavy, how grand. Good for chasing goats over rocks and laboring on the land. in my hair fills me with great fear. I do not know why. Oh, Mother, I cannot bear it. I shall never be the same again. Thank you. 
deserts and across the seas do you have thoughts and memories are these bright blossoms that bend and gleam the lilies of sheer hasharim curious flowers of red and yellow flames i do not even know your names so many's the shades and scents that mingle colors mix in my eyes <laughs> my nostrils tingle Are these bright blossoms that bend and gleam the lilies of Shirashiri?
for this new life under the sun. Let me, dear Lord, be able, strong, to learn, to labor, to belong. Days pass, and always I look forward so to this. How good the water is. Nowhere in Yemen water so quenching. Water so precious. So clean, delicious. shepherd have you ever left a lamb a small she lamb motherless and ill alone on a hill <laughs> Shalom, Tamar. Shalom. Gael alechet lamut? What is she asking? She asks if uh, Yael is going to die. Oh, dear. I just telephoned the hospital. And I'm sure she is getting better. Anna Tilfina Berega Zelebeta Holim, Vamrula Shen Marisa Harbeo Tertov. Alti Dagi. Akolietov. Tamar, the doctor says she is getting better. Tamar, Yael is your Tertov. 
your teeth, too. My own eyes shall I believe when they behold Yael. My own arms when they hold her close to me. Doesn't she look happy with the baby? It must remind her of a little sister, Yael, you know. I think I have a good idea. Assign her to the baby's house and make it her special job. You're right. Tamar! 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 Tell her your heir will be well by Passover. That will help her over the first few weeks. Tamar, your heir will be well by Passover. Not at the Teachers, babies, lucky babies, you are not too young to live here. If there is place for all of you, there must be some for Yael, too. Come Pesach, she will be well again. shalt thou labor and do all thy work but on the seventh day is the Sabbath of the Lord suddenly there is a pleasant commotion all about they hurry in from the fields to welcome the Sabbath bride singing as they march even the land shall slumber the oxen sleep the plow rest leaning on its side This is the Sabbath that heralds the coming of Pesach. My heart grows giddy on the wine of my dearest hope that my sister will be with me at the Seder table and read from my Haggadah and drink from my cup. clean for the Sabbath, bed and body. How good to be with comrades making ready. Hurry, for the sun goes down in the west. Six days have we labored. Tomorrow, rest. He looked and saw that it was good. The world was good. When he was finished with his work, he rested then. The world was good. All things he made, star, stone, and sea, and every animal, had made them well. He looked and saw what he had made. The world of things, the world of men, was good. He rested then.
set aside all worry when the Sabbath comes. No labor and no hurry when the Sabbath comes. Nor burdens may we carry when the Sabbath comes. The traveler shall tarry when the Sabbath comes. With peaceful thoughts arrayed when the Sabbath comes. Sit ye in the shade when the Sabbath comes. Be fearful and betrayed when the Sabbath comes. Rest, be not afraid when the Sabbath comes. one makes mention of Yael, can something be wrong? Can it be they are deceiving me and she will not be here for the Seder? Already we are preparing for Pesach. Is something wrong? Quickly hope becomes despair. I have been waiting for Yael to come. Perhaps she is waiting for me. Crying for me. She could be dying. Whom shall I trust? Oh, Mother, whom shall I believe? We understand your financial difficulties, but don't you see 
In this case, the happiness of two children is at stake. If you reject the small one... They lied to me. They said it was decided. Yael was to come by Pesach. It is not decided. They have not accepted her. It is heartbreaking to reject many small little children. But we have no choice. We await your argument seriously before we came here. We understand that if we want to save Tamar, we have to educate her together with Yahya. Therefore, we decided to make another exception in this case and to say yes. Oh, Raquel, I'm so pleased about the decision, aren't you? I'm very glad you know that. But don't tell Tamar. Tonight let her sleep. And tomorrow she too will have her festival of freedom. abandoned my sister. Forgive me for leaving Yael alone when she was sick and needed me. Never, never will I leave her again or believe these people who say they are our friends. Anna, Anna, 
Where is it? I found these clothes in the field there tomorrow. Oh, dear, they are. I must go now. But where will you go, Anna? Where will you go? I go to the road. You go. You go and pick up Yale from the hospital. All right. Yes, sir. Oh, Anna. If what you don't it? succeed, try the Marlboro. She may be at her aunt. All right. Shalom. 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 Six. Any more? Seven, eight, nine, ten. What's that over there? Why do they seek me out? Oh, why do they not leave us alone? Come along. Tomorrow, your elder met the Masada. No, 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 no. Ten, boy. No, 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 no. Tomorrow, your elder met the Masada. No, 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 no. Tomorrow. Yael, they met the Mossad. Believe me. They may. Ken, boy. Have I been wrong after all? Let my eyes behold her. Let my arms embrace her. Then I shall know. Oh, I pray it is so. lost lamb. At last I have thee close to me. Oh, praised be the Lord. Praised be he. Oh, mother, she is well.
night different from all other nights because once we were slaves in Egypt and our God brought us forth with a strong hand blessed be he who keepeth his promise unto Israel I will rejoice in the Lord in many ways in dancing and in song acclaim See how my toes tap on the sacred ground he promised long ago to Abraham? The Lord remembers. I will witness his love to Israel. I will proclaim. I, who am nothing, he took my hand. The desert did not swallow me as I fled. The sheiks who could have killed me did not command. The Lord remembers. He guided me to Aden where the sea begins. I sat in the body of an eagle that roared. Our shadow touched the holy crags of Sinai, where Moses received the tablets of the Lord. The Lord remembers. The eagle came down. I walked out of its body on steps of velvet along a silver rail. I walked as out of a dream, my eyes beholding the promised land, the land of Israel. The Lord remembers. Thank you. 